We're back and talking about what everyone's buzzing about this week. Yeah, such a busy weekend. I mean, here on PTL this week, we've taken you to a German party, Irish Fest, uh -huh. a fair in the park, and a Steelers tailgate that's still going on right outside here. <laughs> but how about something for the kids? Yeah, Rad Days begins today. It's a 40-day event. Yes, you heard that right, 40-day event where families can enjoy free shows and concerts at places like Phipps, Carnegie Museums, and more. RAD, by the way, stands for Regional Asset District and supports the region's parks, libraries, and arts and culture organizations. One of country's music's hottest up-and-comers is in town and performing tonight. His name is Chase Matthew. Here he is making his debut at the Grand Ole Opry. Well, he's going to be at the Roxian Theater tonight for his Love You Again tour. He has more than one million followers across social media. And Morgan Wallen, who was in town just last week, just added him to his playlist. Okay, so certainly someone to there watch out for. Very yes. cool. We also want to tell you about some music Saturday in Butler. It's happening at the Big Butler Fairgrounds. Take me back to Chicago featuring Danny Safarin, co-founder of the band Chicago, will be joined by the Butler County Symphony, which is sure to be a really amazing event. What a neat combination. And Carnegie will be having the 12th annual Ukrainian Food Festival. It's going to be at Saints Peter and Paul Ukrainian Orthodox Church. It's today and tomorrow. Hours are 11 to 7 both days. You can dine in, you can take out, you can order by phone. The point is get the, the, some food from there. It's good. We told you there's so much happening. There's also a big Italian festival in La Trobe tomorrow. It's happening tomorrow and Sunday along Thompson Street in the city's first ward. You'll be able to enjoy great food and drinks, crafts, music, and a bocce tournament. It gets underway tomorrow morning at 10 and it's free. I've been waiting for a bocce tournament. <laughs> All right, and yarn, quilts, and lots of crafts. That's what you will find at the 36th annual Fall Fabric Fair. It's happening tomorrow at the Salvation Army Center on McNeely Road. All the money raised goes toward the group's programs for families in need across Allegheny County. Since it started, the fair has raised more than 680 thousand dollars was is super impressive it is don't be like kids over the summertime and say you're bored this weekend because there's plenty to do it's just a little bit of what people are talking about in today's berg buzz watch for more next time on ptl